Um, and then a, a, a next problem was related to what ICT and the Internet does to democracy, uh, which is we have all this uh, big data and, and um, we think it will enable the many um, uh, to control the few, if you will, and to create this almost intuitive type of democracy where everyone can participate. But at the same time, it's not at all clear how this real sharing of data interpreting them, basing decisions upon them, debating them, uh, and, and turning them into actionable points will eventually take place. So that's a whole new area to worry about. Uh, then a remark about, uh, a point was made about trust um, on, on various occasions. Uh, we have to redefine the social contract and the trust between a vastly empowered individual and a government which has vastly more power to control him, for example. Um, but also we have to build and develop a strategy maybe <coughs> to keep trust in, for example, the Facebooks, but also your internet providers, the Googles, etc., who know far more already now about where you go, what you are, and what your preferences are than you would want them to know. Um, uh, and, and the second order problem attached to them is what would happen if someone would really get access to this information and the bad news was well they did Google has been invaded for at least six months by someone they don't know whom and they did uh, whatever they don't still don't know um, so there's a battle of trust you could say between the data providers which is we all and those that own our data uh, for our goods to deliver the services we want to protect us for what we want, uh, illnesses, for example, um, uh, and uh, uh, also the potential they have to do something really evil there. <coughs>